Deden Kimathi University of Technology in Nyeri County now pride itself as the first facility to manufacture nanotechnological products such as the integrated circuits and sensors used in electronic gadgets for the global market. While presiding over the launch of the semiconductor technology factory, President Uhuru Kenyatta observed that the factory has been set up amidst the pandemic and relies on the expertise of locals who have proven to be up to the task. A very modern plant with almost 100% Kenyan man and woman power. I think that is also wonderful. Our ability to be able to become an industrialized nation, to be able to create good quality, well-paying jobs for our young people, and to be able to turn Kenya from a country that consumes products from other parts of the world to a country that exports not only her products, but her technology. President Uhuru Kenyatta further added that more factories would be set up in the country, including ship manufacturing in Kisumu and Mombasa, saying that the setup of industries such as weapons manufacturing plants recently in Ruiru are saving Kenyans more and offering job opportunities in the process. Soon be in Mombasa and Kisumu launching shipbuilding in our country. We are getting back to the place where we want to now be making our own locomotives as was there earlier on, to be able to turn our country into a producing country and not a consuming country. The Semiconductor Company Limited CEO Anthony Gidenji called for government support as they embark to make a mark in the global market. Machines don't run themselves. It is you who make those machines run. And I have never been so proud of any team that I've ever had, and I've had many all over the world, and I can tell you, Your Excellency, that this is the top cream. The government is also to this end working on setting up infrastructural developments such as internet connectivity to enable more companies such as these set up shop in Kenya. Linda Koskei K24 TV.